Welcome to SQL Server 2008. In this uh, scenario, we are going to see how to write a simple select statement. Now to write a simple select statement, what we would be looking at is a standard format and the non-standard format. Uh, there is a wild characteristic extraction which would be ba on the basis of star. Let's see what is the general format. The general format is select star. select start from table name now here we have just taken a database org structure now let's see what all uh, tables we have under the org structure this is the org structure database under this we have different tables department employee job position now let's try finding out that what and all information is available in the employee So to write the general statement select star from employee let's try passing it execute so you can see that it generally pulls out when you're writing the select star statement the select star statement will pull out each and every records whatever is present in the table employee irrespective of any conditions no matter if any record is existing under employee it would be pulled out using a select star however to let me remind that select star is not an advisable statement to write because it reduces the performance and it also is not a standard format of writing for example if in case we want to extract all these four all these four, five columns from the employee the standard way of writing is select employee id comma the first name comma the last name comma the age comma the grade from table name table name is employee so here let's try passing this and then hit see you can see here that the entire information is collected this is a standard format of writing if in case you are extracting any information from a table if in case we do not want to have the last name or maybe if in case we just want to have the employee id the first name the last name then how would we write we will write it in the same way but we will not be having here employee id first name last name so no age no grade remove these two columns and then execute you can see here now you're getting only employee id first name and the last name what if you need to have only the last names then remove the first name the last name you can see here only the last name is visible now that means the standard format is select column underscore name from table name if in case you would like to have multiple column retrievals from the tables then in that case here all the columns will be separated by a comma in that case it will be something like select column underscore one comma column underscore two comma column underscore three and so on till column underscore n from table name here you can see that here we have taken select this was column one column two column three from the table name 
in the upcoming videos we will look at uh, some more options of the sql thank you for watching this video